G'day guys, what's cracking? To Aussie here again. So today we're doing a little, a bit of a strange collab. 7-Eleven and Hungry Jacks. So we're getting a little deal that's a, well I've actually just been to 7-Eleven. You might see it in the background there. Been to 7-Eleven and got a sweet little deal with a sausage roll and a beverageino. And now we're hitting HJ's. Just have to be careful here and getting a Whopper Junior meal, well, sort of sort of meal, Whopper Junior with three nugs and a small chips. So all this for 10 buckaroonies. I'd love to see it. What's that number again? I don't know the number. <laughs> Too busy jabbering. Smoke it over there, smoke it again for you. Can I just pick up order 7634, thanks? Yeah, no worries. It's after to the second window. Thank you. That was a bit of a tricky one. That's why I couldn't remember it. So, all this food for 10 buckaroonies. Now, I picked up a sausage roll and it was the last one. I'll show you in a sec. It doesn't feel the best, I'm not going to lie. Thank you. See you later. That's a very small little bag for all that stuff. But anyway, folks, we got the goods. Let's go and find somewhere to have a little manjari and tuck into this sweet little deal for 10 buckaroonies all up. Come with. Rightio, time to get jiggy with it. So, we've got our Hungry Jack stuff stuffed in a miniature shrimpy little bag. I don't know why. Could have used something bigger for that one. We got our sausage roll. Can't see it's say it's feeling the best but we'll soon find out now those of you who do know will know that at 7-eleven sauce is free nada zilch so you don't have to pay for that now with the sauce of course if you don't want sauce that's fine you do you boo boo and we got this lot for five bucks so the winter edition red bull i went with that one i don't think we've tried that yet it's pear and cinnamon, so that's your little sweet little deal. And this, all this for 10 bucks. Now, there was a few different drinks you can get if you don't want Red Bull. I think there was a small Dare Milk, 375ml can. But you can check it out when you go going in there, see what's doing. And also, if you so wish, you can get a Traveller Pie instead of a sausage roll. So, let's check out what's in the bag. Now, like I said earlier, three nugs. Let's see if they gave me four again this time. Sips. You know the drill. Gotta have a chip. Chips ain't bad. And nice and hot. And a Whopper Junior. A Junior. There you go, guys. That's it. The whole kitten caboodle. Plus, of course, you drink. But we'll just... Put that down there and scoff that later. That's everything. Ten bucks. Now, I'm looking in here and I'm seeing again, das Boot. But I won't scan that thing again. <laughs> I don't really care if I don't want those nuggy boots. Everything's nice and hot today at HJ, so that's a good thing. Time to whack it in me gob. I've done it again. Good on your HJs. Four nugs when there's only supposed to be three. So all this for 10 bucks and we got an extra nugget. Does it get any better than that? I think not. And the nuggets ain't too bad. They're pretty good. I think they've improved lately at HJs. Yeah, good thing I got in there when I did. There was only one sausage roll left in the warmer, in the pie warmer. You know what? This is going to be very messy. I already know it. Very flaky. A bit like me, eh? Let's whack it out. Let's see how it goes down. Oh, this is the 7-Eleven brand. Now, this whole deal, like I said, with a sauce, you can get sauce, of course, if you want. Sausage roll or traveler pie. That thing... $4 fibby. Can you believe that? $4.50 for a... I nearly said effing sausage roll. 
for a bloody sausage roll at 7 Eleven. <laughs> but this is why you get the sweet little deals. Now, I'm not even going to try this without sauce. I just want a ton of sauce on this. It's looking a bit dark, isn't it? For a sausage roll. Oi! That wasn't a good idea. Nearly slips sliding away over the edge. I'm expecting a very big mess here, but let's stick it in. Now, I've got to say, I'm usually a bit of a fan of the old sausage rolls, but that one isn't up to scratch. I'll still eat it, because as you, we all know, tomato sauce, the old dead horse, fixes anything. So it does give it a bit more flavour, of course, but not some of their best work, that one. Probably just been sitting in the pie warmer since yesterday or something. How does a nugget and a sausage roll go? Let's find out. No, I can't, don't reckon I can stretch my gob that far. We'll do it. Oh, look, a bit of sauce. Let's give it a try. But having eaten that, let me do this. I need a pepper, you know. That's really making me thirsty. So as you saw, today's Bevragino is the winter edition pear and cinnamon flavor Red Bull. Part of the five buck deal. Let's open up and give it a red hot crack. So you can just go in store and get this. Just pick out your drink. You don't need to scan that thing on the app. Will it be that color? I reckon so. Oh, surprise, surprise. Not one bit, it's more like, well I guess it's pear and cinnamon, it's more of a pear flavour, of flavour, a pear colour, but let's find out, or it's actually what's going to come out later colour, let's find out if it tastes or smells like pear and cinnamon. Let's give him those pear nodes, I can smell it. Must throw you Very pearish, I like it. That's not bad. Now, one thing I didn't think to look at, is it no sugar or any of that malarkey? Or zero sugar? I think it's just standard, so that's probably why I'm liking it. Pretty decent drink, that. If you get the little deal and you want to try that, well worth a try. Now, we'll leave the sausage roll for a minute. Check out the Whopper Junior. We haven't had one of these for a while. What's on a Whopper Junior? I guess it's just a miniature Whopper, isn't it? So we should have lettuce, tomato, onion, beef patty, sauce of course, mayo, does it have ketchup? I can't remember. Oh yeah, there's some redness so it must be ketchup. So, oh and pickle, can't forget me pickles, I just saw one sticking out there. And not a bad little burger for this deal five bucks so all up 10 buckaroonies and we've come out on top i reckon especially with a drink thrown in as well doesn't get any better than this good value and then it becomes a matter of do you want to eat this stuff or not that's up to you but it's time to whack it in me gob A pretty decent little burger now. That one's doing the job, really hitting the spot. So, for value, I'm going to give both of them, and it's lit, I'm loving it. I'm giving it five stars out of five for value. And remember, you can get a traveler pie or change the drink, whatever you want. So, five stars out of five 
each for value, but for taste. The Hungry Jacks has come out tops. Like, this is really good. Chips are good. Nugget ain't, nuggets ain't bad. I'm going to give it four and a quarter stars out of five for taste. And what helps all that along is it's nice and hot today. So nothing cold. This one's average warmth. It's not cold. So, folks, this one, a little bit trashy, a little bit overdone, but still ain't too bad. Like I said, the dead horse fixes anything. It ain't too bad. I'll give it three stars out of five for the sausage roll and the drink. Ain't bad. I'll give that four and a half stars out of five. So, that's your sweet little deal, folks. This one, HJ's, goes to the 12th of August. This one, I can't remember, but it's, you know, got a fair bit of time there. Get in store if you want it. Give it a crack. And if you're not looking forward to a sausage roll, grab a traveler pie. They're always pretty good, too. So, guys, that's me. I'm out of here. I'm going to scoff the rest of this in private. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And remember, you can never be too Aussie. Huru, stay fresh. I will finish that. It ain't disgusting. It just ain't bussin'.